here's some magical video streaming now. Today, we have mystical ideas for witches. And for the first idea, take three metal bottle caps. Are you ready to do some chemistry? You will need some strontium chloride, blue vitriol, and boric acid. Fill the caps with them. Then take an alcohol solution with sicilic acid. Drip it into the blue vitriol. And set it on fire. A copper sulfate solution gives the fire an aquamarine color. Strontium chloride will make a bright red flame. And boric acid burns with dim greenish light. Colorful fire is a very important attribute of all witches. Interesting rituals happen using these flames. But be sure you are very careful trying this out. The life of a professional witch is always boiling over with interesting events. And here is the first client. Oh, wise one, help me. Mmm, love spells. That's my speciality. I'll do it. But I need to remember the words first. Where is my magic book? You need a spiral notebook and a small piece of leather. Wrap the end of the notebook in leather. Fasten beads with red stones. Cover the cardboard part of the cover with purple acrylic paint. A little creativity magic and the label, Book of Shadows, appears on the cover. Decorate the corners of the notebook with leather triangles. Let's go up to a more complex level of magic. Let's make magic ink. You need a clean container and half a lemon. Squeeze the juice from the lemon. Dip a feather in lemon juice and apply magic spells on the paper. For convenience, you can write the letters with a pencil first. Light a candle. Warm the letters from the back of the sheet so the writing darkens and looks like a spell from an ancient book. Most girls come to witches to have their fortunes told and so they can find out where they'll be meeting their other half. Thank goodness our witch has an A in magical geography. Well, let's try to determine the location of your soulmate. Where is my magic feather? No, this is too complicated. We'll need a special magic crystal. Take a stick of hot glue. Use the box cutter to sharpen the tip of the rod. Make uneven sides so that it looks like a crystal. Cover the rod with a layer of violet acrylic paint. Wind a wire on top. Bend a loop. Decorate the top with small crystals. Then wrap it in thin foil. Brush off the excess. Hang the crystal on a short rope. Done! Bring the crystal to the map and it'll show you the location very soon. Wow, there are so many confusing things on these old maps. What are you talking about? All modern ladies use maps on their phones. Open up the Maps app and look for the location in your phone. Here it is. Everything indicates that you will meet tomorrow around this park. But wait, I have something else for you. Mark up a plywood plank. Write the alphabet and numbers, then divide the board into two sectors. Yes and no. Now start painting. Cover the torn border with brown acrylic paint. Paint the moon and the sun yellow. Emphasize the details. Make the yes and no labels bright neon. Color the letters and the numbers. Cut a heart with a hole out of a piece of cardboard. Cover it with a layer of golden paint. Insert a transparent crystal into the hole. Decorate it with symbols. Take a magnet and glue for gold mosaic. Fasten the magnet like this. Take another magnet in your hand and place it on the other side of the board. Move your hand. The heart crawls smoothly over the plank. Oh, spirits! Let us know the past, the present, and the future. The crystal inside the heart will tell us. So what are you waiting for? Write down the information. What did you get? A name and a phone number? Thank you, dear witch. You helped me. You are welcome, sweetheart. Take a potion and a magic cookie with you. As soon as he tries this wonderful brew, his heart will forever belong to you. Pour some instant liquid fruit jelly in a clean, dry container. Add cold water and stir. Fill it with some more water. 
put it on the stove and add some food coloring. Pour the potion into a glass. Add food glitter. What is a potion without magic beans? Pour colored candy drops in it. Fill the glass to the top and serve it with a straw. For magic cookies, you need water, flour, powdered sugar, and an egg. Separate the white from the yolk. Add some icing sugar. Mix it with a whisk. Sift the flour. Mix the batter. If the batter is too thick, add a little water. Pour small circles on a greased baking sheet. Set the timer and put them in the oven for five minutes. Cut a piece of craft paper into thin strips. Write predictions on them. Soon, the cookies will be done. Wrap the pieces of paper with predictions in the cookies. Fold them and leave them to cool in a glass so that the cookies keep their shape. Place the cookies in a bag and invite your guest to take her prediction. Can't wait to see what's inside! Something amazing will happen soon! Yes, soon everything will change and I will finally stop being alone! That's great! Hmm... Muggles are so easily surprised that it's not even interesting! Actually, what will the future bring uh -huh. me? Oh, I knew that already! But the cookies turned out excellent this time! Our witch clearly spent too much time in her room. Isn't it time to have some fun? What are we doing today? Ah, yay! There's a witch party today. Finally, something to do. And I love girls' night out with the other witches. Where is my broom mobile? Bring it here. You need a long stick. Paint it. Collect grasses in a bunch. Secure them on the stick with an elastic band. Now take a can of spray paint. Color the grasses in a bunch. Add bright thematic details. Tie the broom with a thin rope. The broomstick is ready. Let's take off. Real professionals will always have fans. So our witch also has a fan. My dear witch, I want to be just like you. Well, let's see how you handle a magic wand. You need a makeup brush and a piece of shiny foam paper. Draw a star and cut it out. Make stars of different colors, gray and black. They should be different sizes. Glue them together. Fasten the star to the brush handle using a hot glue gun. Use silver glitter for decoration. Draw an elegant shiny spiral on the handle. Take dark blue half beads. Glue them to the brush with tweezers. Decorate with rhinestones. The fan immediately gets started. A witch's makeup is also a kind of magic. As the base tone, use pink shadows. Apply a pink tint to the entire surface of the upper eyelid. Darken the outer corner of the eye with dark eyeshadow. And highlight the inner corner. A little shimmer doesn't hurt either. Apply sparkly eyeshadow to the central part of the upper eyelid. The final touch is the eyeliner. Apply it on the lower eyelid and draw a sharp wing. Color the lips with dark burgundy lipstick. Decorate the area between the eyebrows with a shiny flash tattoo. You will need a piece of thin gold foil. Draw a crescent and circles on the back side. Go over the outlines with a capillary pen. Cut them out. For convenience, use tweezers. Apply lip balm to the skin. Fasten the golden pieces. Stick the rhinestones to the skin. Wow! This style really suits you! Uh -huh. But something is missing! Take a ribbon and roses made out of foam paper. 
Draw letters on glossy paper using colorful hot glue. Write the word WITCH. Attach a flower to the ribbon using hot glue. Glue the letters. Attach another flower at the end of the inscription. Now, take a piece of Velcro. Glue the pieces of Velcro along the edges of the tape. Use Elmer's glue. Fasten it to make a real witch choker. Take it, honey! You will be irresistible! So now I'm a witch too! And I can do magic and wish for anything? Of course! But remember, be careful what you wish for! It might come true! I have the same wish as any novice wizard! A glass of real butterbeer! Wow! I had no idea it would work! You need a beer glass! Print out some pictures! A witch on a broomstick and a witch's hat! Cut out the drawings! Fasten the picture of the witch to the glass. Glue the hat to the straw. Take Schweppes and marshmallows. Pour the drink into the glass. Lay out marshmallows as foam. Decorate the drink with a straw. Well, how do you like this? And now, let's go to the witch party. Did you like our ideas for witches? Comment below which one surprised you the most. And don't forget to like, subscribe to our channel, and click on the bell so you don't miss even more magical ideas from Troom Troom Select.